Hi, I'm Lou and my Yes Welder helmet just quit working, so we're gonna replace the batteries. Pry off the shade dial knob, take off this nut, this plastic piece, and pull it out from below. Inside the helmet, pull this down, and then lift this right out. Bend back these tabs and this will pop out. On the more expensive helmets, there's a battery compartment right there that just slides out and you can put a new battery in. This is a cheap LY500 and it's not so easy. Start here where this cord comes out and get a tiny screwdriver, pry along this edge. And it comes apart like this. The battery is a three volt 2450. The bad news is that it's welded in. So you have to break the weld to get that tab off. There's our liberated 2450. So you can buy these for about $3 and you can weld them back in with a 12 volt car battery. And technically they can get recharged by the solar cell, but I'm tired of messing with it. So I'm just gonna do this. That's three volts and this is 1.5 twice. So same thing. The wires are a bit short, so I'm gonna extend them. This stuff is dang near impossible to solder. So I've just wire wrapped it. I bent the tab over and I'll squeeze it down and cover it with heat shrink tubing. Shrink. I cut out a little notch in the plastic for my wires and snap it all back together. I've got the module back in the cradle and here are the batteries with the cover. Cradle back in the helmet and we'll clip it in. To get this lined up correctly, turn your shade knob all the way to maximum and then line your knob up with 13. My battery pack stuck to the top of the helmet with this double stick tape. So does it work? Yes, it does. Thanks for watching.